Hello, it's me again. Ah, uh, lol. Hey, yeah. there I did it. All right. Ah, uh, I'm gonna tell you. Ah, uh, my mathematics. Ah, uh, how how I figured out a coworker's birthday off her lunchbox. It uh, it had the number eighty-eight on her. All right, so I'm like, hmm. And I put meaning to things and try to figure things out, and I'm pretty good at it. Well, it said 88 on your lunchbox, so I'm like, huh? All right, well, divide that by 2 is 4-4. Four, four. All right, well, the clock hand on 420 is 4-4, four, four, right? So I'm like, 420, all right? Now, next step was to add the two fours together. That's 8. Then add that to 428. Well, to make sure I was right... I normally don't do this, checking people on the internet when they're born and that, but I did. I looked her up and uh, on a circuit court. Anyone can do that, so it's not like. <sighs> Come on! This is just stupid. Anyone can do that, so it's not like. Uh, I did anything wrong. Well, come to find out. Her birthday was 428 so by dividing the eights and getting 4-4 four, four, and then going to the clock and see where the hands point uh I got 420 and added the two fours together and I got 428 and I checked my math on the internet checked the birthday uh, I knew who it was so uh I'm not the only one that does check people's criminal records I mean if you're gonna Boat with someone you want to see how, what, you know, although their past is their past, but I don't mind. A, I'm a troublemaker too, so <laughs> my name is Mud. <laughs> All right, well, anyways, and I uh, that's what I did, huh? But that's how my math works sometimes, and you can do this with your uh, uh, lotto numbers. Pick three is probably your best bet because. And then you only can win 500 and you ain't got to pay taxes on it. And it's only three numbers. So that can only go up to 999, which is cool. Uh, like one time, uh, before I checked the numbers on the internet, what the winning numbers were, I was going to pick them, but I didn't have the money because I'm a poor fool. And uh, so I'm like, before they, I written them down, and it was 715, right? I written 715 due to the time and date and uh, three numbers, you uh, know, uh, did a math equation and, uh, you know, I added this number to that number and then took one number from the date and then, uh, then I add it and subtract it. And it only can be up to nine, so I had to get it down to each number was under nine. And while I went to check, and while if I would have bought one, I had it in exact order. No, no lie, I checked, I checked, checked the uh, one in numbers for the day. And my like, God, I, was, I, I didn't even have fifty cents to win five hundred bucks. What the hell, <laughs> you know? I just, it pissed me off, but you know. Uh, karma will pay me sooner or later for being nice, I hope. <laughs> but that's my math, and that's how it can work, you know. You'd be surprised, just like if you look at the number of pi, it's infinite. But if you go so far, you can get anything out of it. Uh, and, I mean, it, you know, uh, it's... Oh, and then just like what for birthday... Now, this is a cool coincidence. I'm, you can make any coincidence you want, but I have fun with numbers, so this is fun with numbers, all right? Uh, it's 428. Now, add the 2 to the 6. That's the day I was born. Add the 4 to the 8. That's the month I was born. 12, 6. So, that's kind of cool. <laughs> but, yeah, numbers sometimes don't add up, but, you know, it's fun things you can just come up with how to get your numbers you know 
or get something. You know, it's a fun way of doing math. All right. Well, have fun.